go to Jesse on the right. Hey Lance, can you um, take us through what happened to you out there in, in the in the fourth inning and um, what your status is for the next round? I just started getting tight uh, at the beginning of the inning. Um, I got out of it; it was fine. But um, you know, in five to one ball game, especially five to one, especially with how they came back on us a few nights ago, um, I felt like we had the off day yesterday, so our guys were pretty rested up and. Um, you know, I just told him, I said, listen, you know, I'm not, I'm not 100%. So, you know, I pitched the whole fourth inning like that. You know, I could probably do it, but um, I don't think it'd be the best idea. And so they went to the pin and they did a masterful job. Yeah, we're, we'll, we'll see how I feel uh, moving forward. Middle section, back row. Um. Does this feel any similar at all to anything you've had in the past, or is it just something totally foreign and you just have to get some tests? And yeah, it has, I don't think it has anything to do with my ligament. So, um, yeah, this, we'll have to just wait and see, you know, how I feel tomorrow and if we're going to get any imaging done, things like that. I mean, I wouldn't pitch for at least five days. So, um, and there's probably an off day mixed in there. So, six days. So, we'll have to wait and see. Back to Jesse on your right. Lance, I'm curious your perspective. I believe you're the only holdover on the pitching staff from 17. To go to five straight ALCSs with a different staff other than yourself is quite the accomplishment. Can you give me your perspective on all that? Um, a lot of great, a lot of great players have come through here um, over the past few years. Um, we do a great job preparing. You know, our coaching staff, our analytical department, they do a fabulous job, and they put us in you know chances to succeed. Um, so, and a lot of resilience and a lot of uh, a lot of uh, hard work, you know, from our hitters and our position players, things like that. Um, you know, five straight CS is pretty crazy when, when when you go back and think on it. To be one of the last two teams every year. Um, you know, and the a, representing the AL trying to go to the World Series. So I think, you know, when you're in the moment and you're in the thick of it, maybe those things kind of slip your mind. But I'm sure that we'll look back on it. Um, it feels like a good accomplishment, I, I guess, I think. Um, but, you know, we're going we're gonna to try to win it all. Any more questions for Lance? We'll go one more on the back row. Sorry, Lance. It's all right. My fault. Um, could you just speak to the bullpen coming in behind you and really shutting them down, especially after kind of what happened in game three here? Yeah, I mean, what a job by Yumi Garcia, you know, being able to bounce back and throw the ball that way today. And then, um, you know, Phil uh, was pretty brilliant in his, I believe it was inning in two thirds. Um, just outstanding job. Uh, Stanick coming in, uh, Gravy doing a great job, and then Presley, you know, shutting it down. So, um, you know, it was, a, uh, it was a pretty classic Astros win. You know, good pitching, good defense, timely hitting. Um, away from home, imagine that. And uh, came out with a the, with the series win. And another one from Jesse on your right. It's kind of was what I was going to ask you. Um, you know, maybe not being a hitter, you can answer this now that the series is over. Do you think those guys are fueled by all that negativity and the latest one, Ryan Tapera's comments? No, I, mean, I really don't. I really think they don't. I mean, we're, I think they're pretty secure in themselves, uh, you know, who they are, what they have accomplished. Um, you know, I don't think they're going to, you know, allow a comment, you know, from someone like that bother them. Uh, you know, he, he got a tip of cap to him as well. He came in and threw the ball well today. I know we got the run off him, but he comes in after saying those things and threw the ball well. But, um, you know, we, I mean, it's a laundry list of people now. Uh, media, fans, players, and uh, yeah, I don't think it's going to stop anytime soon. All we can do is just keep doing our thing, keep winning. We have a we have a close knit uh, locker room, and uh, like I said, and you know, a comment from from someone like that's not going to not going to matter to them much.